Hello YouTube, today I'm just going to simply show you how to personalize Windows 7 Beta. This is easy, but for those of you who don't know how, this is just going to show you how. Sh go to the desktop, you can go here if you have a bunch of things open, just click down here, show desktop, and it'll simply minimize everything for you. Right click on the desktop and click personalize. This, as you can see, will bring up a new um, icon down here. Now, this is how to change the background and the themes. You can choose, um, this is the theme right here that I'm currently using. Now you can also choose these. Now this does make it look like it's been reverted to an older Windows, just because instead of the little Windows symbol, it actually says start now. Now these are cool. As you can see down here at the bottom left, now it looks pretty much the same. Now it looks like Windows Vista or Windows 7. Now you were given a bunch of other themes and as you can see like on this one right here you can see there are like it looks like there are four things this rec square then these three rectangles that's because in Windows 7 this is a cool new feature it'll actually siphon through the pictures it'll go through them in a continuous cycle you can choose how often you want it to change that's a really cool feature and I thought that was pretty cool I finally noticed it um Another cool feature is all of the gadgets that you have the same ones but you can download them and as you can tell if you want this it puts it up here and it'll put it as if there were a sidebar but um there is no sidebar and a lot of people have noticed this it's a lot cooler now because you can actually just you could do this on Vista but now you're given a little bit more freedom with the whole um organization you can still edit these like you would um Windows Vista still can change all of the options put these over other ones delete them as if you would normally and um, this is a pretty cool feature that uh, plenty of people have said that they enjoyed now um, feel free to send feedback to Microsoft to make this look a little different because it does look a lot like Windows Vista now um, lastly I'm going to show you how to change the screen resolution this is simple just right click on the desktop and click screen resolution right here uh, this is a pretty cool thing you can connect to a projector as it says right here or just press the keys now you can choose the resolution here you can set the size but I'm not gonna set it um, but I will show you this is a fun thing to do to mess with other people's computers it, they will have no clue what they do see it says flipped when you do this it will I'll click apply and just show you now this will freak them out because if I'm I'm moving the mouse downward right now just because it flips the controls as well now I'm gonna click revert but um that it's just a really fun thing to do um it's hilarious they have the um portrait flipped as well and we'll just see what that's like this one it's this one is really fun because it now this one is a lot harder as you can see with the mouse the way that it's moving um, it, it's just really fun because you choose these and they won't have any clue what they're doing they'll wonder what happened to their computer because it's a lot harder to navigate with the mouse now um, that is it uh, feel free to check out the other Windows 7 videos I will be posting uh, feel free to subscribe thanks